Nothing can be more frustrating when you sit down to watch one of your favorite programs on Crackle and you run into issues streaming it. Well, in today's tech video, I'm going to show you how to fix Crackle if it isn't working on your Roku device. I'm going to show you a few really simple ways to try and solve your problem and get it back up and running again. The first one is the easiest one to try, and that is to unplug your TV from the wall outlet and wait 60 seconds. Now don't be impatient here, wait the whole 60 seconds, then plug it back in. This is very different from turning your TV on and off with your remote control. This is what we call a hard reset of your TV, so make sure you do this method. If that doesn't work, then find the router that is giving you Wi-Fi and unplug the power to that for 60 seconds. Then plug it back in. If it fixes it, great. If not, let's move on to the next method. Try deleting the Crackle app on your TV. Go to wherever the apps are located on your system and remove the app altogether. Then reinstall a Crackle app again. After you reinstall it, you might have to log back in with some of your credentials, but hopefully this will work. If that doesn't work, then I recommend buying an affordable Roku stick, Apple TV 4K, or Amazon Fire Stick, and plug that into your TV to use as your main streaming player. You'll be able to access the Crackle app that way. I'll put links in the descriptions down below of where you can get one. Well, hopefully this video was helpful for you. If it was, go ahead and click a thumbs up on it. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I make tech videos all the time, and I would love to have you back in the next one. Take care.